Hello and welcome. My name's Stephanie. I'm here at Crosstown Autos Used Car Super Center. Today we're going to be taking a look at the 2014 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland. We have got a beautiful vehicle in the store for you today. Underneath that gorgeous hood is a 5.7 liter V8 Hemi engine and I can't wait to turn it on and hear it roar to life. We've got honeycomb styling on those grills there got our daytime running lights and beneath that we have fog lights and tow hooks underneath our fender flares we're gonna come on down to see that we're riding on top of Goodyear Wrangler 18 inch nitrogen filled mud snow tires so these rugged tires equipped with disc brakes are going to be resistant to both heat and cold temperatures gorgeous We've got a mud flap there to keep things nice and neat, an aftermarket step to help you into your vehicle, and a breakaway side view mirror with defrost. We've got a blinker indicator on the back of that breakaway side view mirror as well to help keep you safe when you're changing lanes. This is a fantastic vehicle with tons of features on the inside as well, so why don't you come on in with me and we'll take a look. All right, so we've got our remote unlock here. Um, there's a couple of great features about this key when it's got remote trunk open Two, it's a proximity key So we're just going to put it into our pocket as we walk on up now the vehicle is locked at the moment We're just gonna put our hand there and it unlocks Beautiful, let's open it on up now. This door does open nice and wide so it's easy to get into and out of your vehicle coupled with that aftermarket step here we've got storage we've got a speaker and we have our power options windows mirrors and locks we've got an extra speaker up there as well very nice check out that cool styling on the inside there now here's our power driver seat with lumbar support we've got that cool embossed logo That up there is a sunroof, and we'll play with that in just a moment. There's our sunglasses storage. There's the dash. There's neat pedals. All right, let's hop on inside. Very easy for me to get in here with that step and that wide opening door. That's fantastic. So this is also a push to start key. Um, so I'm going to be putting that safely into our cup holders. and starting it on up. Beautiful. Here is the uh, steering wheel there. Let me straighten it a little bit. There we go. So I'm going to be using these buttons to navigate the menu here. All right, so we've got our dashboard menu here. We've got lots of fun information We've got our, let's start with our speedometer here. Now we've got two views. We've got the digital view and the more traditional. Uh, we are going zero kilometers an hour right now because we are safely parked. We can change it to miles per hour if we so wish. And here we've got vehicle info. So we've got tons of great information. Tire pressure, transient temperature, oil temperature, oil pressure, oil life, battery voltage and we're back to tire pressure very useful here we've got our current terrain mode um, and we've got a couple of cool uh, graphics there showing the information uh, here we have adaptive cruise control with driver assist very useful we've got our current fuel economy and we can keep track of up to two trips trip A and trip B Here's our currently playing. Here are our stored messages. Uh, here's our screen set up and we're back to the speed. All right, so coming back, I'm looking at the steering wheel and all these great features. We also have some hands-free calling buttons. So you can hook your phone up to this vehicle for hands-free calling. And here's the voice recognition button. Cancel. Cancel. Pretty cool. Very useful. Here's our cruise control, and if we wrap our hands around the steering wheel, we've got volume controls. Now these are powerful speakers, in my opinion. I barely had to turn it on at all before I started hearing the music. 
If we wrap our hands around the other side of the steering wheel, we've got tuning. Pretty nice, I like that. All right, so this vehicle is equipped with AM, FM, and satellite radios. Very nice. So, here we've got our media button. Um, we can play CDs, we can, uh, we can also hook up a media device via USB, auxiliary, um, Bluetooth, and you can even put an SD card. For here are our controls. So there are heated seats and vented seats. I'm going to turn that on now because it's a little warm in here. There's also a heated wheel. There's a heated seat for your passenger and a vented seat. And let me tell you, I'm feeling that vent vented seat already. It's very nice. All right. So here are our climate controls. This is a dual zone climate control. Um, so you and your passenger can choose what works best for you. And you can also sync them up in case you do not have a passenger with you. So we've also got our navigational apps here. We've got our phone phone uh, button here. So if you connected your phone, you could do things such as redial and mute, transfer, join calls, uh, phone books, recent calls, dial, messaging, and settings. Pretty cool. So speaking of settings, there are tons of settings that you can change. You can personalize this vehicle to a very big degree, and I love that. It's great. All right, so here's our dual zone climate control. We've got the more the uh, manual settings there. We've also got our front and rear view defrost, our hazard lights, um, eco mode on, collision detection, park sense, and uh, we've got a button to turn traction control off. If we press this, it'll fold on up to show us where we can hook in. Let me move that so we can see better. So we can see where we hook in our auxiliary USB SD card and there's an extra power outlet down there. Here's our cup holders, our transmission. And then let's move this here so we can get a better view. Um, here are our select terrain modes. So we have automatic, mud, rock, sand, and snow. Uh, we've also got four-wheel drive low. This is so cool, in my opinion. I just think this is the coolest thing ever. You know, like, because we live in Alberta, right? So say it's like a heavy snowstorm you can turn it to snow mode. Or if you're off-roading, you can change it to like mud or rock or sand. It's just so neat. I like it a lot. I love Grand Cherokees. All right, so here we have our storage space. There's a CD player. Here is an extra power outlet. And something else that's super cool is um, just the stitching on the side here. I just love the stitching. All right, here is our locking glove box. For an extra layer of security here's the detailing on those very very comfortable seats and up here is the sunroof if we press this button then we can open the cover and take a look so there's not just one but two sunroofs in this vehicle so your passengers can enjoy the uh <laughs> cloudy sky just like you can really nice all right, let's open this on up, shall we? Beautiful. If we can close it back up just with a touch of a button. And in case you don't want it all the way open, but you want to let some of that hot air out, you can vent it. Really awesome. So to close the vent, you just push that button. Now we've got our lights here and we also have a trunk open button right from there. So that's super cool. And there are those lights on the back, which is also useful. We'll press this again and it'll close on up. Really nice. Here we've got our sunglasses storage. There are so many cool features in this vehicle. Why don't you come along with me and we'll take a look in the back to see what else we can All find. All right, here I am in the back of your Jeep Grand Cherokee admiring this passenger side door with the speaker, storage space, and power window. 
Here is the back seat. Really lovely. Lots of features, such as the hard backing to the seat. Very easy to clean. We've got these bag hooks here, as well as mesh map storage, where you'll never lose anything. All right, fantastic. So there's something else that's cool here. If you pull this down, there are cup holders for your back passenger. They also have their own vents here. USB slots, power slots, and super cool, they have their own rear seat warmers, so nobody's going to go cold in your vehicle. All right, something else that's super cool is that these seats fold down. Pull this, and it folds on down, giving you lots of extra cargo space. Really great. Speaking of cargo space, let's uh, close this up and check out the back. Now, I love those tinted windows. <laughs> lots of privacy. All right, here we have the back of the vehicle. We've got our rear windshield wiper. We have our um, exhaust ports, dual exhaust ports down there. There is the backup camera. Um, and we've also got our tow hooks down there. And we have our pins. We've got four and seven. Really fantastic. So let's open this on. So up. what's great is I have a remote trunk open here. It'll open on up. Super easy. Fantastic. Here we've got our cargo cover. Well, that's a cargo space, a speaker, bag hooks, an extra power outlet, storage space, hooks for tie downs. Underneath here we have our spare tire. This is so cool, lots of space, and imagine how much more space they could, there could be if we put both seats down. Something else that's super cool is if you press this, the vehicle's trunk will close on up after beeping to uh, alert you that you should get out of the way. <laughs> oh, we've also got rear parking sensors. I almost forgot that. There are just so many cool features of this vehicle. I feel like I must have missed some just because there's so many. That was the 2014 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland. If you want to book your test drive and check out all these cool features for yourself, we're just a click or a call away here at Crosstown Auto. Thanks for walking around with me today. We hope to see you soon.